<laughs> I forgot my mic and my, my camera. Of course. Uh, give it a second here. Come on. Uh, kick in. Come on. There we are. Cool. All right, now let's get playing. Picking up where we left off in the last episode. Currently not in an active main quest. All right. I scraped my knee skating today. Ooh, are you okay? Yeesh. It is just a flesh wound, of course. Use that as motivation to fight some alien baddies. All right, so what do I gotta do next? Uh, da, da, da. Hide from the main quest. What's that all about? Nothing. Could use a sh quick uh, land on an asteroid. Nope. Base travel. Base station. Uh-oh. Ready our weapons. We have been invaded. Let's move. One new encounter. Uh oh. Space pirates! Oh crap. Get you some contagion. There we go. Poisoned. Oh, the confusion didn't work. It's not very useful. Explosives. Explosives. Die, space pirate scum. Ah, oh, he resisted the poison. Poisoned. Oh, well, thank you for lining us, getting in line. That'll be very useful. Die! And die. There we go. Victory! Oh, we got a bunch of soda cans. Slight chance to recover your party's spell points at the end of a battle. Oh. So that's gotta be a meta shop item, right? Yes! Alright. Well, I won't know when there's any, uh. Yeah, brain fart. Any, uh. Boss battles coming right up, but. Chance to recover spell points is useful. Currently own zero. Gadgets. Uh, piercing. Yeah. I got miscellaneous. your critical chance by 7%. Eh. Aerodynamic suit. Me Buy more rat burgers. Bye. Hold it on me. Bye. There we go. Well, I didn't get the double up on that. That would've been nice. Removes all negative statuses from your target. Ooh. Hey, I can cure my poisonings. And I am 
all out of cash. That's okay. Because I need me some cure alls. All right. So, what do we do now? I am recalibrating the HMS Pepe's navigational drives. Seems like that planet Echo, previously deserted, is now being occupied. Wait a second, this planet didn't exist. Of course it did. You just, um, need to pay more attention. Maybe we can find clues to the danger to the system and, and the hawking system there. Mission start. Space travel. Planet Echo. This planet was recently colonized by a delegation from Earth. Brave new future. Uh-oh. Zoom. On Echo's spaceport, you find a dolphin curiously examining you. All right. Oh, medbay. This is medbay to recruit... Store your crew's psychic and physical health. Oh. Okay. Oh, it's so cute. And it's apparently a flying dolphin. Hey, keep those hands to yourself. Eh, sunshine? How rude. This isn't Earth. What are do dolphins doing here? Setting a dolphin colony, smarty, smarty pants. If we haven't been around, why did you set up a colony world of your own? We got tired of our lack of communication with humans. Yeah, people can be annoying sometimes. You're telling me, and now Earth has caught up with us. They've sent di they've sent diplomatic de delegations. No, it's just one really annoying guy. Say, I don't suppose you could put a stop to him, could you? It'd be a lot easier for people who can, you know, look intimidating. We just need him kicked off Dolph Dolphinopolis <laughs> and off planet. We'd pay. Uh, that's well within our experience. Okay, we'll reason with them. I love getting help from total strangers. Just be warned, this guy is seriously pig-headed. So are we. He's met his match in us. Let's go. Uh-oh, planetary travel time. All right. To the unknown location. All right. Dolphinopolis. Space talk. You're crossing the area when you encounter a doctor. She's kicking the spleen out of some bandits. And stay down! That was badass. Nothing special. You pick up all sorts of tricks when you're on the road. What do you travel for? I study the history and peculiarities of plan each planet I visit. I'm Dr. Pond. An archaeologist. An archaeologist and a geologist? Uh, the dog's locked out behind the gate, dear. That's like a prestige class. And who were those guys? Members of the Anti-Science Society. They've been trying to shut down my work for years. They sound like creeps. Say, if you can see that, and you look kind of useful, would you like some work next time I need a hand with them? Sure thing, give us a call. We were too late to help this time, but count on us. Superb! I'll be in touch. She, go back to, she goes back to her examination of the soil. Dr. Pond is now available for intercept missions. Oh, what do we got for shop? All right. Tutti Fruity Essence removes all negative status from your target. It also heals your targets. Huh. Astronaut food. Oh, I'll have to remember that next time. Uh, Nano machine suit. Lime luminous stone. Watch. Ah, the C plus <laughs> plus. Shock gloves. Radioactive welder. And an energetic deodorant. Okay. Interesting. Some items to look into later. But having a fully stocked inventory has probably been for the best. 
Why would anyone come all the way to here to hunt dolphins? Even whaling stopped centuries ago when the whales fought back. Well, talking dolphins are stupid. Watch out, it's a space troll. Yeah, we haven't forgotten you, uglies. Just came to say that this is the worst campaign ever. Two out of ten. What does it matter to you how we play the game? Go do something productive already. Lol, like I have the brains for that. I mean, er... I'm no bad. I'm bashing your heads out. Defeat spa four space trolls to continue your mission. Let's get them! Strike! Nice. Free skill use. Epidemic time! Get him! Poisoned. Oof, that my shields. Nice. Fusion. No. Die already. Ah, god dang it. Space poison. No. You people in the back, too. Confusion. God. No. How do you, how do you shoot yourself? Get everyone. New time. Ah, oh, crap. More confusion. Get you some poison. Poison time. Cure to the poison yet? No. Nor the confusion. The confusion that space trolls bring. Just sucks. Alright. Get some poison. There we go. Shotgun to your face. Poisoned. Poison you some more. Come on. Next person. There we go. Down for the count. Curse you cheaters. I'll be back for you. Well, guess we know which human is causing a ruckus. You do? Who? Or, I mean, yeah, of course you do. Very easy green sh chick. It's only logical. Let's run around Dolphin Office so we see if we can catch this guy. Ah, uh, Wendy. Based Wendy has leveled. I still don't see anything I particularly want to purchase right now. Ah. Uh, do have some gold, though. <clears throat> I need to refresh my mana pools, though. There we go. Right. Inventory, mana, use, and use, and use. So based Wendy, oh, probably because she leveled, that's why she was that cool. 
You've been walking around Dolphinopolis when the sound of turmoil draws your attention. Soon the turmoil finds you. You! I thought I was rid of you forever. I mean, you've been gone for six weeks and all. But no, you've come back to get in my way again. Unacceptable! Six weeks? Yeah, figured you'd disappeared in a black water black hole somewhere. Dude, that's the least dramatic non-calculated time jump ever. Well, it's been six weeks. I waited to get back at you. And this is a very acceptable opportunity. Trolls! I'll need that stupid tech of yours. Can you toss me a cigarette, dear? Time to get some poisoning. Poison. Right. Oh, when I hit him, that gets rid of the confusion. Okay. That's okay, so you can't damage someone who's got confusion or it snaps them out of it. How dare you. I'll explode your face. More marks. All right. Quarantine. I'm going to quarantine you now. Nice. What's the point of having this ability if everyone's always immune to stun? <sighs> Load your face. some damage. The first is marking. Now you can't dodge. Mm. That hurt. That hurt a lot. <laughs> oh, man. Okay. Let's heal you up. Buddy. There we go. Still marked, huh? Party. Come on. You already. There we go. Let's see if I can 
set you on fire. Ah, you suck. It's not very nice. There we go. Ah, he teleported away again. That big minigun wielding maniac escaped again. One 2D fruity essence and one ginormous gloves. It's like dual wielding gloves in a single slot inventory. Increases damage by crit chance by nine. Oh, damage by nine. Crit chance by eight. And critical damage by 26. Nice. Huh. These guys gotta be cheating. Time to bail. Come back here, you traitors. That's unacceptable. Ugh. I waited six weeks for this. We could feel your anticipate. That's the guy I was talking about. No problem, Aquatic Galactic Citizen. Let's call Nebula Command to pick this guy up. Again! Hit girl, you try contacting Nebula Command, but all you get is gibberish. Huh? Did we break our comms by time traveling? Comms have been pretty bad all over the galaxy lately. Don't you think we tried calling the cops about this buffoon? Yo, no need to be rude. You know what? If you're gonna be like that, I'm out of here. Ginormous uses his jetpack to escape. I think you hurt his feelings. Anyways, this comms thing could be part of the big future threat we keep hearing about. I love conspiracies. We should go check with Nebula Command. Hit girl companion, Nebula Command HQ is located on a space station in our time. It's called Police Station. You're going, huh? So long, and thanks for all the help. All right. Time to level up. All right. Almost got enough for poison. Hit girls at three points to spend. Law of the Strongest. Applies stun status to your target if your target has marked or dead short status. Raises your whole party's damage by 25% for the next three turns. Uh. Not a bad concept. Uh, let's see. Extra damage if the target is stunned. All right. Hmm. Your attacks remove all your target's shield if it has dead short status. Hmm. I don't have that ability, though. Oh, that could be useful. Oh, since stun doesn't seem to be working anymore. So we got to figure out scan. Eh, nothing that really... Alright. Spurg. We got. Alright. Place those with this. Yeah. Yep. That is better. Alright. Now to keep on rolling. Oops. See what we got here. Space talk. 
Here we are, high above the clouds, but our feet are on the ground. Let's get to business. What's the daily offer, or should I say the planter? I'm willing to trade ten Stormite for one gadget. Just a gadget? Hmm, okay. Alright, alright, yeah. But you don't seem to have the ten Stormite. He goes back to his business. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Board the Pepe. Space travel. Brave new interest. All righty. The police station. What, hun? Oh. All right. No, you don't. Unplug it, put it in the dishwasher, and run it in the wash. Just make sure you've tied up the cable. Oh, you did spill soda on it earlier. Yeah, it's an old-style keyboard. Just run it through the dishwasher. All right, what do we have in the shop? Rat burgers and first comment license. The high threat value is kind of self-explained, right? Raises your initiative by six and your threat by 12. Uh. Police station is clearly a mess with lots of staff running around at their wit's end. It's been a while, soldiers. Oh, hey, Val. Not patrolling anymore? Not so much. Easy green chick. It's Captain Parsec now, soldiers. So, can the captain give us any information on this communication disjunction? Seems one planet is acting as a bandwidth black hole. It's consuming all the bandwidth in the galaxy, to be exact. What are you doing to counter this bandwidth banded tree? <laughs> Indeed, the chat is yours, dear. <laughs> I was just setting out with a trooper squad to resolve this, but then you showed up. We're the squad now. Exactly, hit girl. That's why I like you, bunch. Here are the coordinates for the, our problematic planet. Torrential on the Turing system. I trust you'll deal with this exceptionally well. Great. Now we have official permission for something we'd be doing anyways. Spurg is leveled up. And still, there's nothing I particularly want to purchase. Uh, I wish I had more skill slots. All right. Back to the Pepe. Can I dink around with the space-time continuum again? No. Boo. <laughs> Careful, Darnell. She's got the wrench. She's got the power in there. <laughs> ah! Space pirates. You see a container going through an unstable wormhole. What will you do? Wormhole? Isn't that dangerous? Forget the container. Does the HMS Pepe have any sort of hook device? Maybe we can pull it in. Alright, let's do it. Ooh. A one Mach 3 boost. An RG belt? Okay, I have no idea what those are, but let's take a look. Raises your initiative by 5. Raises your damage by 9. Hmm. That's... Could be a really useful. Yeah, I think that's probably gonna be a better option. Uh, she's already pretty fast. Raises damage by seven hit points by. Raises uh, hit points by twelve. Hmm. Pretty fast. 
the shield run by nine. Yeah, I don't really see any of that. <laughs> to the Turing system in the Pepe. Mentat. The intense cold on this planet is used in many mental acuity training programs. Warning. Hostile ship is orbiting. Oh, a torrential. This ribbon planet offers only a narrow band of habitable land. Torrential may have been a lush planet once, but now is tightly locked to its star. Only in its twilight zone is habitable. One hemisphere is dark and cold, the other is burning hot. Hey, what's with the solar panels? There is indeed very heavy bandwidth use here. We should investigate. As you look around for clues, you notice there's a floating door nearby. What? Roll. Oh, and it seems to be guarded. There's nothing to see here, punks. Beat it. There's a floating invisible door right there. Is this an invisible secret base or something? Yes, I mean, no. I mean, ah, let's cut to the chase and just fight, okay? Not very effective, uh, security. <laughs> cut to the chase? What is this, Hollywood planet? As the disorient skill, right? Let's get some treasure. Attack! Ow! I ain't screwing around. All right. Gets uh, the most of them. Poisoned. My poor shields. Oh, Ooh, what the heck happened there? Ow. Get you guys in the back. Kill him if I do that. Ooh. Let's mark everyone. There we go. Ah, you resist my mark. Oof. That sucks. See if maybe I can get more than one person with confusion. And poison has been applied. Nice. you guys. There we go. Uh. No! She has to hit herself in her head. <laughs> Alright, let's get you to your confusion though before you end up killing us all. <laughs> Alright, uh. Yeah, 
try the best player. <laughs> we was space marines and stuff. you on fire. <laughs> oh, stun work for once. Right. Shotgun. There we go. Victory! Whatever is in there must be pretty hardcore. You think so? guy lives on a Saturday morning cartoon villain's planet. Hmm. Should we be smart about this or go in heavy? Let's storm the place. I love that idea. There's no way it could go wrong. You storm the house. All right. Cyber police here. Hands where I can see them. What the? You done goofed. What are you talking about? Stop hogging the whole galaxy net, you. How am I supposed to illegally down all the Flix series I need to watch? By the way, no spoilers, please. You... Wait, there's no evil plan, just downloads? Huh. You still have to stop. No, I'm not stopping. I'm downloading all the galaxy net. That slows it down for everyone else? That's their problem. What a selfish jerk. You dash into my house, insult me, and I can't do anything about it. You won't fight? I haven't left my house in ten years. You think I know how to fight? Val Parsec suddenly storms in. I decide to provide some assistance, soldiers. <laughs> Resting me won't stop my super PC from downloading the entire galaxy net. My legacy will live on! You're going straight to jail. Aww. Soldiers, shut this place off while I take this cyber delinquent to the police station. She drags the guy away with the cyber chair and all. At least that is taken care of. All right. Okay. While looking around the messy room for a way to shut off his, his computer, you find a trap door. Maybe there's an underground base of sorts. Should we go down? We might not be able to easily come back once we enter this trap door. Let's make sure we're all well prepared for the challenge ahead. Translation. Let's do some healing quick. Items. Use. 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 Alright. Uh, use. Definitely need you to use that. Uh, Bella, watch that somewhere else, please. Let's put headphones on. Alrighty. Prepare to attack. Everyone ready? Let's go. The underground dungeon looks like more like a huge power complex. On closer inspection, you see lots of optic fibers and hubs. I'll take a uh, cigarette here. No wonder he had all those solar panels installed out there. Not so fast. What was that? Security measures in place. Answer correctly to proceed. Or else. Ah, uh, I hate tests. Question Wood. In Ed Wood's classic 1959 movie, Plan 9 from Outer Space, who plays the lead? Ah. Uh, uh, this is where I cheat. Because I just watched this a little while ago, and now I can't remember who the lead was, because Bella Lugosi isn't the lead in Plan 9 from Outer Space, though. 
Uh, let's see, lead. Actor. In. Plan. Nine. From. Outer. Base. Uh, let's see. Do. Gregory Walcott? Hey, there we are. Correct. You're worthy of proceeding. Next room, here we come. As soon as you go down another level, the automated voice speaks once more. Who is Yuri Gagarin? Uh, Yuri Gagarin. Oh. Uh, first human in space. Yuri Gagarin went to space on April 12th, 1961. Go right ahead. Let us proceed. Oh. The automated voice greets you to the underground base's third level. The galactic government is run by the Galactic Council? Correct. You may pass. On to the next room! Another level, another security question. What is the class of the HMS Pepe? Um... Frog? Correct! You should know your own ship, after all. Okay, we're done here. Let's keep going. Another security check plays as you descend another level. What is Ginormous's hair color? Ah, oh, shit. Uh... Green? Wrong. It is important to know your enemy. You know security measures are on. Oh, crap. Uh... Strike. How do you have black hair? Alright. Ow. Grenade. That's gonna get you away from me. Grenade! There we go. Be confused and hurt your friends. Thank you. Strike. There we go. So how does a robot get poisoned down? <coughs> These are questions I should probably not ask. Shotgun. Uh, ba -ba -ba. Quarantine. Very nice. been mocked. Do you shoot? Hey, there we go. Down for the count. Fine. Get a shotgun to the face. There we go. Marked. Marked for death. 
Hand grenade. It's a good quest, a good possibility there, um, Darnell. And consider that maybe it's just damaging the circuits, and that's poison for a robot. There we go. And... X! There we go. Oh my god, it's still alive. How dare you mark me. Shotgun! Slayer bins. Two true thousand volt rat. Ah, ah, ah. It keeps going down. It's time for another security question. That downloader guy was paranoid. Question six. What's the galaxy's most popular burger? Well, that burger, clearly. Correct. But too much junk food is bad for you. Oh, God, my legs are starting to get really tired. Security question plays when you reach BF7. What is the galaxy's physically strongest race? Simians! Correct. Simians are a proud warrior race with overdeveloped biceps. If only he had an element. You're on the underground level of eight. Your ears start to pop. What method is used for traveling from one system to another? Space gates. Correct. Gate catapults ships across different star systems. Or a teleportation device. Seems like you're getting to the end of the complex. Thank the stars. What is the name of the planet you're standing on? Torrential. Correct. You have a good sense of direction. I think Easy Green Chick is out of breath. The voice sounds once more. Though mechanical, it seems to be getting a little hoarse by now. Last <laughs> question. What was the first creature you fought on your adventures? Ooh. Uh. Mothtoids. Correct! Pesky little insectoids, huh? Congratulations on reaching the end. You must be hurt, hungry. Have this pizza. One 3D printed pizza. 3D printed? I hope it's at least topped with Rato pepperoni. Let's press onwards. I think we're close to the end. You reach the last room in the underground complex. Finally. How are you, gentlemen? The shape begins to materialize out of thin air. What? Why is it a cat? It's you. What are you now? I am here born to this place. Here, uh, I am here born to this place. Denomination, dogs. High level idiom is hard. Attention colleagues, this DOGS program is endeavoring to hack into my systems. Please prevent it from subverting my systems. Let's hack him a beating. Please do. You beating me probability zero and falling. All the galaxy, all your galaxy net are belong to us. Looks like we found our future danger. You have zero chance to survive. Ow. Burn, kitty. Bad kitty. Oh, shite. Do I have anything to bring her back? Oh, I know. I think I'm out of a, uh... Shoot. 
I am all out of the ability to bring someone back. All right. I better do poison her. That's gonna suck. Dad. How dare you take out my healer? Ah, god dang it. Poison's gonna kill me. Alright, uh... Yes, it is. Fine. Attack! Alright. Let's recover some... Man. Now, shotgun. Critical. All right. I need to heal. Uh, da, 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 da. Have a hundred percent of your shields and your shield regen in twenty twenty percent more. Well, that's not gonna help me. Oh, okay, I'm just doing damage straight through my shields. So, strike. Poison on me, or I'd be owned. Shotgun. Moose. Most. Most shotgun as I can. Axe to your face. Ah, he resisted my burn. Now you short out my shields all you like. I'm gonna set you on fire again. Alright. Shotgun. There we go. Rehydrate. Uh, shotgun. At least the poison, at least the fire is keeping the shield from regenerating completely. Ah, not poison. <laughs> Uh, uh, running out of poison gears. Back. Running out of, out of uh, stuff to re-heal up my mana, too. Oh. Shotgun. Dying today. Got him. Victory. One plant plated cat sticker. A cute little plate sticker on for your weapons. It draws attention from the enemy enemies and helps conduct energy to your shields. Raises your threat by ten and shield regen by fourteen. Ah. Looks like you've got disconnected. The future downloads say in the future it waits. It is not a void of a rule. Your time to survive. 
downloads from the future. Talk about being apocalyptic and cryptic. Indeed, Dogs was streaming data from the future times. Somehow. I will attempt to decode it. Dogs is being slowly deleted while, your while the facility shuts down around you. I have noticed I can download Dogs digital residue if you so desire. Really? His unusual nature and technology could be useful. What if he's dangerous, though? He did try to corrupt Tadpole. I must warn you. The window of performing this action is closing. Let's at least get it before the chance is gone. Roll. Hmm. Are they able to download what's left of dogs? Should I download the dog got uh, the cat dog, dog cat, whatever? Sure. Refresh that. Refresh. I don't know why the cameras have such problems. Again. Tadpole quickly downloads all data relating to dogs. This data is badly corrupted. I'll start a background function to restore it this very instant. Also, I'll save it on a floppy disk as I don't feel comfortable carrying this thing around. Great. Thanks, Tadpole. Let's head back now. The pressure is hurting my ears. Soldiers, it seems the galaxy net is back to normal. I can t contact you while watching cat videos and doggos. Well done. We saved the future and the galaxy net in one go. Coincidence? I think not. Mission complete. One B graded diploma. Degraded knowledge item. Raises your spell points by nine and regenerates your spell points by four each turn. That could be very useful. All right. Gadgets. Uh, da -da -da. Ooh. Ah, da -da. Yeah, that's going to be much more useful. There we go. And, oh. Pick girl leveled. Uh, let's see. Increases shield regen by 14. Hmm. Yeah, let's do that. Alright, we're gonna head back to the ship, and I think I'll call that for today on board the Pepe. And exit the game. Well, thanks for watching. Have a good day. And all that.